Hey, good morning, YouTube. What's going on today? It is August 22nd, 2017. We just got done with the big old Great American Eclipse. Oh my goodness, what a big old show. I didn't really get a chance to look at it very much because I was at work and I only saw it for like two seconds during a break. And then I went back to work, like people should have been doing, but whatever. Uh, you know, a curious question that I had uh, yesterday it was this. Um, how much productivity did the United States lose during the eclipse yesterday? Because, you know, you I read articles sometimes about the loss of productivity whenever you uh, whenever we have daylight savings time and is it beneficial to have daylight savings time and this and that and the switch like is it really important because you know I live in the state of Arizona where we do not observe daylight savings time so we don't lose any productivity supposedly so yesterday I was thinking how much productivity are we losing because of this solar eclipse and how many millions of people are stopping work to go look at this thing let me know what you think down in the comments below and you know you can tell me now what where you were what you were doing I was at work so um, I'm a school teacher so I was teaching my class full of uh, students and um, I paused it uh, I, I stopped class for about two minutes to show like a live feed so right there I'm losing productivity I mean case in point I mean I'm trying to argue was it worth it or not but I again myself I'm doing the same old thing I'm losing productivity too so and if you think about all of the elementary schools and all of the middle schools and all of the high schools that across the nation that was able to view this thing, how many students weren't doing work? And I mean, yeah, granted it's one day, but one day, a lot can happen in one day. You know, nations can fall in one day. Think about that one. Nations can fall in one day. And so, you know, I was just thinking about that yesterday. It's been a while since I did a vlog, so um, I've been doing a lot of things in my life right now. I just got started back at work a couple weeks ago, uh, kind of getting back into the groove and move of things. And um, so, like, uh, school started a this is our third week of school so I've been getting in the groove with that and this year I'm feeling pretty good uh, with the class and how I've set it up and I'm really pleased with uh, all of that and uh, I've been working a lot on math videos for my channel and uh, putting the effort in for my students so um, I'm seeing some payoff there, but you know, this channel's got a lot of different things on it and it's for a lot of different people. Um, I've always thought in the back of my head, would it be good to start a separate channel just specifically for math or just specifically for vlogging? But you know, that's not really who I am. I'm kind of a person that has a, uh, a lot of different things going on and I, I like to share them all so uh, if you're here for the math videos awesome if you're here for the vlogging videos sweet if you're here for the reviews that I do every so often and the silly kind of things that I do that's great keep it up uh, I really appreciate your views and I really appreciate uh, the support but my channel Hopefully I can get it to evolve in a little bit. You know, I've been thinking about ways to make it better 
and you know I'm always gonna get that uh, person say well you should uh, drift or crash your car or get a speeding ticket or do some brakes and yeah that's all fine and dandy but you know I don't want a one-hit wonder video I want all of my videos to be that up there you know so that's something that I've been trying to think about how to do and I'm continually working on this new editing program that I got oh I missed that fly um, so I've been working on this uh, program I got that's really sick and I can do like cool edits and stuff and uh, I've been trying to think of some sketches and uh, little things I'm trying to work on so that uh, you know my vlogs are that much better and you know the next big thing that I really want to do for my channel is in my vlogging and my hobby I consider this a hobby and something I enjoy doing I'm thinking of getting uh, I, the next thing I want to do and get is a better camera because right now you guys are seeing me on a GoPro and it's a it's an older GoPro so um, it's it's so old I have to have um, an external battery plugged into it just to keep it working and a lot of the times the video files that it makes get corrupted somehow so uh, I have trouble uploading the videos and editing them and tweaking them and so um, I really need to invest in a better camera but I, I don't have the money for that and so right now I, I'm just gonna stick with what I got um, I got a little microphone but I have I'm not recording with that now because it's in the trunk um, but if you've been paying attention to my math videos, um, you notice the sound quality is way better because of that little microphone. And I just, I record on that microphone off of the voice recorder app on my phone. I plug the microphone into the jack and, um, I use the voice recording software there and I email me the file. I email myself the file and then I can upload that into the new, uh, video editing program that I have. Um, I really want to start making some really cool intros and stuff, especially with the driving with Matt, you know, because I really want to start picking that up again. And so what I need to do is I really, I just need to start listing topics of stuff that I want to talk about so that I can continue to make these videos. Um, somebody that I follow, uh, driving me crazy, this is a shout out for you. Um, he, I really look up to his channel and the things he does. And um, I want to try to do some more things like that because that's initially where I started my YouTube channel is the driving with Matt about a year ago. And I would talk about something or just how my day's going or whatever. And it was just like a 10 minute little special, you know? And so I want to kind of get back into that. Uh, but a lot of it boils down to how much time do I got? Do I got time to do it, you know? So, um, cause I have three kids now and, um, that's kind of consumed my life and I love my kids to death. Uh, but now that school's back in session, uh, I got work to take care of, students to take care of, my family at home to take care of, and we're trying to sell our house. So uh, that's kind of part of our plan. And uh, it's kind of out in the open, I guess. But um, that's part of our plan right now. And, it, and it's kind of taken over uh, my life. So. Um, I'm not stressed out, but I'm, uh, I, I'm busy. I'm really busy. So at the end of the day, after the kids go to bed, I usually, uh, 
go back to work. I go to, I do work at home on my computer and, um, I get ready for the next couple of days of school and I try to plan out a couple days in advance now. I think I'm at that level, but as a math teacher, it's really hard. Oh, I knew that was going to happen. I really try to plan out for uh, the next, you know, couple of days, but it's, it's really hard because um, each class is different and each class uh, sets up um, the differently, the lesson goes differently, even though it's the same lesson, it just, it goes differently and you know, it's hard to set that up for a week in advance you know I can kind of plan out things I want to do but as far as the actual lesson goes that's a little more difficult you know something else that I figured I just thought of right here this is a little off topic uh, something else I thought of that I could actually add to my channel and improve it is probably a better dashboard mount for my GoPro I, I would think that I should invest in that maybe for Christmas or something. Ask for Christmas. Hey, I want a new GoPro camera mount. That'd be pretty sweet. You know, I did a review on the current one I have right now. And it's it was solid then. But uh, you can actually check that out uh, on my channel. But take like I think the suction cup on this thing is just not doing so good anymore. So uh, as far as that... Um, as far as that goes, uh, that would probably really improve the channel too. It's a better suction cup mount. So if you stay tuned this far, uh, driving me crazy, there's a shout out and, um, you guys should go check his channel out. He's got some pretty cool stuff. I think he's almost at 1500 subscribers. He's really grown in the last like. Oh, three months, I think. Uh, so, yeah, that's awesome. Ooh, man, someone's got a new Lincoln. Dang, that's nice looking. But anyways, uh, I'm at work now, and I'm going to leave you guys with a positive. Um, hopefully, you guys have a great, happy day. And uh, keep grinding, whatever you're doing. And uh, it's going to be a good day today. So, we'll see you on the flip side catch you on the flip side and uh have a good one